Hey, look, hey, hello, hi, How, how's everybody doing? <clears throat> I hope everyone is having a wonderful time, as I am. I'm going to show y'all one second what I'm doing. Okay. So since my this video is going viral, oh my God, I'm not complaining, but I am adding my name to it. So I'm going to redo it on mine, and then I'm going to spread it out. Since everybody's getting views and sharing and likes on my jish, I might as well do the same thing, right? So I'm just adding to it so people could go ahead and start following me and everybody could stop using my shit, getting views and shit. But hello. I have went to uh, get a massage. I'm gonna take one of these off. You see, I've been bundled up. I went to go get a massage earlier. And when I tell you that man put them fingers in his forearm and elbow all in my back and to the lower parts of my cheeks, I mean, he had fucked it up. I went to sleep in the chair. Then I came home and passed out. Said, fuck it. Just go to bed. But, oh, I feel, oh, my God. What have I been up to? Nothing much, just living it. Living it, doing it, doing it, and living it. That's about it, you know, getting my jib. Okay, so I'm going to pick up Gia. No, Gia coming over here. Because I'm not going to pick up nobody, honey. And brunch is at 10 or 9 o'clock or 11. Woo, that's kind of early, Jill. Well, let me see. We start this evening going right. I think I may go out tonight. If not, I'm going to go to the movies. Let's see Taraji, uh, the movie. And now that I'm thinking, well, no, I kind of went today after that massage. I said, fuck everything. I didn't even go pay my, my water bill. And that's why I was even in that area. was paying my water bill. Got a massage and said, fuck it. I'm taking my ass home to pass the fuck out. And that's what I did. Find this thing sexy. Oh, thanks, love. This body is ripped. But I have to eat, though. Because it's too ripped. So I can't be flossing that off right now to everybody. It's, it's hot, but it ain't hot for me. Yeah, I want to see Proud Mary. I love movies like that, though. I just wish I had somebody to go with. Somebody fun and cool. Not a relationship or not a date. Just a a cool somebody to like, bitch, let's go to the movies. But I'm pretty sure at this hour, 7 o'clock, bitches edition. Or they should be, because they trying to go out and get fucked anyway. And still going to come home with a clean pussy. Is everybody getting fucked in the butt? 
Did I just say that? I have no advice to tell you how to keep a man because a man going to get in a hole if a man wants to get in a hole. The only thing I can say is do the best you could do to keep him happy. Because I don't know. I can't tell nobody how to keep a man. Because if he going to cheat, he going to cheat. So, <laughs> it ain't, let me reroute you. It really ain't much you can do. The only thing I can say is just do your part and be faithful. So if anything go down, it won't be on you. Because, baby, if your man want to cheat, he's going to cheat. And keep your friends out of your shit. You know what I mean? I don't tell friends my business. Uh -oh. So, I don't know. Let me reroute you. Hey, Wesley. Wesley, I'm tired as hell, Jeff. I went and got my back cracked. Not the way, you know. Just. Little lean man went up there and got me together. So I don't know what to tell you, Jerry. I'm drunk as fuck. What? You drunk as fuck? What time is it? Where you at? Because, baby, it's 7 o'clock over here in California. And, yeah, now. Uh-huh. Right. Uh-huh, they getting the tea. That shit go viral on my page. Not nobody else's. Let me post it. <clears throat> oh, I love you too. Panties, bitch. I always wear panties. Unless you're having a quickie, then run all over there. Don't have on no drawers and panties. It's 3 a.m. You in the UK? Okay. That's why 3 a.m., baby, you're in the UK. Trust me. You're nowhere near in the United States. Because that time, that hour... Is the wrong fucking hour. But you know what I said I was going to do? I was, uh. <clears throat> what page is hilarious? What video did I put up there? The one I just put. I am going to do another video in that same week. Since that picture and that hair and that look is so iconic. And I'm going to make sure people know who I am. Because I'm tired of people using my shit. And not um, knowing who I am, just tagging me in it. I'm not going through a whole year like that. Not again. No, ma'am. No, ma'am. And it's like eight people that hit me up and said, we. every time there's a fake account with me on it, they always report it. They send it to me. They report it. And then I report it. Tribute to Selena. Where the fuck is this at? That's tonight. At 8. 10 dollars. Albuquerque. Baby, please. I ain't gonna make that. I got a girl named Luna. Will give me a whole damn Selena concert during brunch. So I'll watch my girl Luna. Hey, Jess. Oh, thanks, Jess. Hey, Jess. Let me see, girl. Queen, Jazzy Masters, have something to say. I see your videos ever, and they don't tag you. Because they don't know who I am, Amandi. They don't know who I am. Don't have a clue of who I am. I have been in stores before. I, I don't, you know what? I don't know if I would do Celebrity Brother in the UK, though. If it came here, yeah. But if it went to the UK, I don't know. But I would not be in drag every fucking episode or the whole time. Unless they are paying me a hunk of change to do that. 
Baby, y'all not going to get that. No, ma'am. And if I am, trust me, it won't be no padding, just a little bra, some titties, and everything else is loose. They'll see body one good time, or maybe a few times. But not too many times. I won't be up there doing all that tucking, adding all them pads and stuff on. Nobody got time for that. Because the little clips I've seen of Courtney, she always in drag. I know she got paid for being in drag all the time. <clears throat> but that's all day. That ain't going to happen with me. I don't think that could happen. It has to be some coins up in there for that. And I'm being serious as a motherfucker. I'm pulling a RuPaul card. If you need me in drag, baby, you got to pay that money for that, honey. It works for Ru. It's going to work for me, too, because I'm not doing that shit. That's cute and ugly at the same time. I won't show it because I don't want to hurt nobody's feelings, and they may be on my jail. But I would love to do, I would, I would do regular Big Brother. It don't even have to be a celebrity. But I wouldn't be in drag all the time. Mm -mm. Nobody had time for that. Sure, I have not. Baby, I'm trying not to block you. I'm really not. But it's something about you just don't vibe with me. I know you must be young. But I don't have no tea on nobody's business. I have tea on my own business. I don't give a fuck about other people's business. I haven't watched Celebrity Big Brother. I probably won't because I never watched it before. I just found out two, three years ago <clears throat> that they was even a Celebrity Big Brother in the UK. <clears throat> I never watched it. <clears throat> don't know how to watch it. <clears throat> Excuse me. So I don't know. Oh, you ain't been missing nothing, baby. Nothing at all. Yeah. I do. I love Big Brother, and I'm into the challenges and all them courses and stuff. That's always been my type of tea. Like I don't mind, you know. Flipping over some shit, falling. I don't mind all that stuff. I don't have Netflix. <clears throat> so I don't watch anything on Netflix. I don't have Netflix. I don't have Hulu. I don't have Ho-Ho. I don't have none of that. What I do have is a fire stick and cable. But I don't have internet. <clears throat> I mean, I don't have Hulu. So I honestly don't even know what the hell y'all be talking about. What's that? I'm in Gary, Indiana. Baby, can't talk to you. We're all the fucking world. What are we gonna be doing? This is from my twenty-one dollar. How's guests from Big Brother? I have no idea. I have no idea who was my favorite from Big Brother. I don't remember who was all on the show. I barely remember their names <clears throat> when the show was on. So to remember their names now, whoop. It's, <laughs> baby, it's not going to happen. And the one that I keep thinking ain't even Big Brother. It's what was that show they had on MTV? Cribs, not Cribs. What was that show they had <coughs> when they go like <coughs> to like a like to Miami for like the summer? 
That's a group of them. I keep thinking about that show. I did watch Cherry Pop. And it was it was funny. I fell out on a few parts. I don't think I watched the full thing. I think I kind of got it in the middle. But it was funny. I posted some videos on here, Wesley, about it. The real world. Bingo. I need you in my corner. Y'all too. Y'all got it. No, not Jersey Shore, boo-boo. It's called the real world. And it was this one guy, <clears throat> and I can't remember. I just remember he was buff and white. And to me, he was cool as fuck as far as I can remember. And he got drunk the night before, and he was laying on the floor, and he woke up, and his face was red, and his hair was spiked up, and he was like... And they was falling out. And I died laughing off, off that episode. And I could not find it. Funny me. And, and they died. Yeah. His ass was fucked up. He, and he woke up. He was just red. Just drunk as fuck. Just like. <laughs> Bad Girls Club. Oh, I used to love to watch the Bad Girls Club. I did. I really did. My sister turned me on to that when she moved here, when she was going to school. And um, we used to watch it. And I remember her saying she wanted to go in there. Oh, bitch, no, you don't. And you can make phone calls. And people, babies, she called me and said she got into a fight. King, king. Because I'm in that fight. I don't give a fuck. You're not fucking with my little sister. Sorry, boo-boo. I'm so sorry. I'm ringing motherfuckers around in circles because I'm not having that. And then they're like jumping. I'm like, girl, if you call and say you got... I, I wouldn't even have to do nothing because it's a million people. But I'm just... No, ma'am. I'm always going to be the first one there. Let's roll. Fuck that. They just always... First, let's go. We got to handle it. But, you know, Judy was crazy. <clears throat> I sat next to a Fupa. What was Fupa's name? Tiffany. Yeah, what was that girl name? They said she had a Fupa. I sat next to her on the damn plane. She was cool. The one at Megan. Cause she whooped that she was whooping that ass all the time. Walking down the hallway, she be bump the ass. Bop, 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 bop. Like, uh oh. She beating up one like this and whooping the other one like that. She was tearing that ass up down that hallway. How she beating up both of y'all? And she got one and she just whooping this other girl ass, fouling. Tearing her ass up. You talking? All right. Talk, talk, talk. Tanisha was your favorite. <laughs> she was like, bang, bang. I didn't get no sleep because of y'all. You're not going to get no sleep because of me. Wait the fuck up. Bang, wait the fuck up. <laughs> <coughs> oh, my gosh. She was whipping that ass. Megan was tearing that ass up. They used to treat people so bad, though. Putting their clothes up over the rail and putting them in the water and doing shit. I would have been when them side one of them bitches head with something. Because you're not going to... I don't see... I don't know. I just can't... I just... my my I just can't get tortured. I don't want to get tortured. And that's torturing somebody when you do stuff like that. That is torture. That's a sign of bullying, a sign of fucking torture. Because they, I don't know. But if somebody did that to me, oh, baby, please. Lock them doors. I would have walked and started locking doors. I don't need to get all y'all, but I'm about to get one of y'all. I'm going to get y'all later. But I am about to get one of y'all. Watch this. 
and I would make sure I would be whoever asked that. And I'm, you know, I'm not violent and all that, but you're not gonna fuck with my shit and fuck with me. No, 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 no. I seen pops back out somebody for five dollars when I was younger. Give me my money. So all I know is to just, but I'm cool with people. Yeah, them hoes is nasty fucking heifers. There's something on this ring that is cutting my finger. And it hurts too. Damn. Oh, wait. That was some goo. <clears throat> Am I full? No, Jeff. I just got out of bed about before I don't hear. I talked to my friend for about 10 minutes on the phone, and then I wanted to smoke, so I came in here and got on it, and this is the first one. And baby, I don't get full. I get lit. Okay? You just say, just was lit, la la. But right now, I'm not even on a la. And I'm trying to get la la. Because I'm off tonight, and I want to get my jush. Shit, I feel a thousand percent better. I'm back on my Jose Cuevo, eighteen hundred. Now I'm not drinking it. You know, I'm just saying that's my my inside Jose Cuevo right now. And I want to go out. I just don't know where to go. Cause we don't have black clubs out here, so. <laughs> Won't be going to none of those. Other than a little bar, but you know, it'd be old men in there. Mm -mm. They'd be older than my mama and shit. Time to talk. Baby, you older than my parents. Back there, ass. We can't do nothing but be friends at the bar. Wait, let me see. Did you get up to Tony today? Wake up. No, I, you know what, Chris? I didn't even get with Tony today. Let me see. No, because I didn't even call him to see what the tea was. Because I knew I had stuff to do. But I did get a hateful, disrespectful, just low down, put my ass to sleep massage. And I was in the chair like this. And I told that man, baby, please don't come in here trying to rip my insides out. Just give me a medium massage. You know, just get up in there. And he did everything I needed. I mean, I left them all. Fuck the movies. Fuck my, I didn't pay my water bill. Fuck that water bill. Brought my ass in here and went right to sleep. Fuck it. Any, only if I go to Gold Coast. What's, what's in there? I ain't never been in there before, I don't think. But you know what? Honestly, I don't really think I need to be out in the weather like that. No shade. You know, because um, being in the club is hot, then in here, in the cold, and people talking. I don't, you know, I want to make sure I'm gonna make. I want to make sure I'm good. So I'm going to probably go somewhere that's a little bit more open. I don't know. Maybe I'll just go to the movies or something. Because I do have taste for some nachos, extra cheese, jalapenos. And I take a large fruit punch. 
Best scene ever. <clears throat> Tamar concert was off the chain. And it was the whole concert. It was nothing bad about the concert. But to see Tamar live, to see all them live was like, damn, but my girl Tamar, baby, please. Them girls that was on that tour was singing their asses off. Every last one of them was singing their asses off. But Tamar, me and my sister was fucking it up. Pop it! Pop it! We was hood riding. <laughs> he want that hot sugar, sugar. Yeah, we was. She had brought the, the thotty up out of us. Then she sung Superwoman. She fucked Superwoman up. I'm like, I only heard three well. So far, everybody I heard seeing Superwoman that I could think of fucked it up in some type of way. The old girl. Girls, Patty, Gladys, Dion, they shut it down. Then Fantasia came and just. Then Tamar came and just said, let me just go on and seal this up. And it was a wrap. Can't nobody do Superwoman no more. They could let that go. And there's a lot of single hoes out there. Girl, don't even try it. Because you don't had a whole variety covered that one song. They still that. You can't come and do nothing different. Maybe Lettuce could come in there and scat it up a little bit. But other than that, mm -mm. Superwoman is closed. Oh, that was a video I was going to do about Superwoman. For DragCon. Baby, when is DragCon out there? I'm coming out there in July. I'm going to be, I believe, in Australia in July. I believe it's a five-day tour. Could be six, I'm not sure. Kiki Y, yeah, it's a few. But I mean, not too many, though. We just gonna leave it at that. I think I'm gonna go see it tonight, though. Instead of going to a club. Because I really want some nachos. So I think I'm gonna go down to the movie theater down the street. Because there's one, like... What, six? Five to seven minutes from my house, one street, movie theater. Right there in Culver City. And I know I'm going to see some damn celebrities out there because somebody's always out there, but I don't ever know who they are because don't see no shit. They be white, you know, I'm be paying attention. And I'll be looking at people like that. And some of the black ones I don't look at because I don't want no problems. And then when I realize who they are, I'm like, oh, shit, that was such and such. But then I'll be like, they regular like me, let them go. But... You know, because Sony, Sony Studios is right here, and it's another one right here. And then they got all the buildings where they do, like, contracts and all that stuff. It's like driving right down the street. One day I'm going to go live and do a video just so y'all can see, like, oh, this is, I'm right there. It's so weird. I don't like going down there at night, though. Ooh, I don't like going too far. I don't like going to Universal Studios in the I don't like being on the set on, on the dark. Because the big posters scare me. They're really big because the posters are humongous. And they, they frighten me. So, you know, I don't. Yeah, that's where they do game shows. Baby, it's, it's right here. I'm telling you. I can smoke two blunts and get there. Because it's just right fucking there. you like, bitch, you right here. Yeah. And then, like, going up this way, another 15 minutes, going up one street, I would hear Melrose, 
and then that's Paramount Studios is right there. Just 10 minutes, 15 minutes up the road, and I make a right, and there, there go Paramount. It's crazy. I'm living right, I live right in the middle and around this shit. But that, that shit scared me. No shade. Them big posters of people and all that. Ooh. It just frightens my nerves. I'm just like, oh God. Somebody, oh. It's creepy. Maybe because I have visioned it and it's like, you know, that's really. I'm very close to Venice. Venice Street is a street block, avenue, something. It's like the next street over because I'm on Washington. No shade. And I'm on <laughs> I'm on Washington, so Venice is over. And Venice Beach is like maybe 20 minutes down the road, just whew, and I'm there. Parked and walked on the beach. Fuck, I have to be up at Oh, God, I need to be in drag at what time? Let's say like 8 o'clock in the morning, 8, 9, 10. I need to be in drag by 9 o'clock in the morning. No, by 8 o'clock, 8.30. I think I'm going to have to drive my ass down to this club and get ready. Because I don't think I want to get up uh, Sunday like that. Because tomorrow I'm not getting home after I leave here. I don't get home until about one thirty, two o'clock. Oh no! <clears throat> Somebody just said Proud Mary was bad. Damn. Don't tell me that. But yeah, tell me that. So I just wait until it come on Facebook. It'll be on there in a couple of hours or by tomorrow. I'm going out tomorrow to smoke weed. I'm ready. Baby, that's between you and your family. <laughs> I have nothing to do with that. I am not your counselor. I'm not your provider. That's between you and your kids. I mean, you, your mama, and your daddy, or your guardian. So whatever you feel like doing, that's up to you, baby. Don't bring that over here to me. What the hell you expect for me to do and say? <laughs> I don't give a fuck. <laughs> Honestly, I really don't give a fuck. You know, that ain't my business. Shit, people come over here. I think I'm going to kill myself. But baby, you know what? That ain't going to solve shit. But if you feel like it, then that's between you and your, you and your God. Shit, you can't bring that stuff over here to me. They're trying to get me to say something so they can try to make that go around. No, baby, you can save all that. That's between you and yourself. Do I agree with the hell? No. But I don't know what you feel. I don't know how much you can take. So that's what you got to go through. But then I pray for your soul and, you know, your spirit. I wish you wouldn't, but I don't know what to tell you. Shit. That just don't be, you know, I just, uh-uh. Don't, don't, don't try to put that on somebody. And don't try to put it on me. Because. <laughs> <laughs> Baby, that is, you got too much going on for yourself.
And that just, you know, man, you don't have me the house and turn it and came down think and sleep because I'm thinking about somebody on the internet talking about they want to kiss yeah, baby. Huh. I don't do with, I don't deal with stress, boo boo. You can't stress me out. But I mean art I mean, for real, am I, am I lying? I mean, shit, people try to do things to put stuff on people's minds and hearts and shit, bitch, don't bring that shit to me. I got enough. The I, the R, and the fucking S. I got to make sure I pay their asses when I'm supposed to. Shit. I got bills once a month, rent, and car note. That's enough to make me toss and turn. I don't need nobody else bullshit. <clears throat> like, fuck that, baby. I'm not the one for that. And they had tried to let Tyra have it, because I guess she's told somebody, well, kill yourself or do something. <clears throat> and she was like, well, what else, What am I supposed to do? I mean, what can I do? You telling me this? <clears throat> if you're going to do it, do it. Shit. I was like, well, that's how she felt about it, you know? But you know what it is. It is people just turn things into more than what it is. Baby, I'm about to block you. I look like your history teacher, okay? What is credit score? <laughs> Find that out, Jim. <coughs> Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Right. Followers, 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 followers. Everybody finding out who the dish is. Past that, I wish I could. Oh, I miss you too. I'm not sure what niece and nephew you are, but I'm sure I miss you. Oh, you know what? Let me go on and post that up too. Oh, wait. Damn, I don't want to do that. Damn. See, they got another thing going off. It's shit. Hey, girl, you change your picture. i see you tomorrow with your dress. Because I have to be down there, so I bring your dress tomorrow. Oh my God. <clears throat> you did what? Vogue for you? Baby, Vogue? I don't know how to Vogue. I used to know how to. Do all that stuff.
Yeah. I used to know how to do it. <clears throat> and I'm sure I still could, but baby. I don't be having time. I think the last time I did that shit, I had did a kick, a jump kick, and I said, back out. And my nose started bleeding. I said, fuck that, bitch. I won't be jumping and high kicking like that no motherfucking more. Fuck that. The fuck? So, you know, all that wasn't in my, in my aura. But I've never been a part of a house or nothing like that. I have a lot of friends that's a part of the house. I just never want to be a part of one. And I'm so thankful that I never joined one, though. But I am thankful that I did go and, you know, supported them and did all that um, stuff. But being a part of one, no. Because I've seen some people get their ass whooped now. I mean, I've seen some people really get their ass lit the fuck up. And, um, you know, I just didn't want to be a part of that part. I mean, because I've seen some people get their asses whooped. Like, damn, that bitch that chop, and they went over there and whooped that ass. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. <laughs> Can I serve hands? I know how to defend myself. So you could take that however you want to take it. But I would punch the fuck out your ass. Best believe that. I'm not having that shit. It's either me or you. And I ain't trying to let it be me. So, no ma'am. No sir. What's going on, Jamie? What am I scrolling up to? Let me see. I had a meeting with HR today. They said, <coughs> touch my mom. When I tell my mom. Yeah, that's fucked up. Did they... Let me see how my... But he don't work there, right? But he just come up there. I thought you said he got fired. It's something called a restraining order. A hundred feet from you. You guys, you guys suspended from school from beating this annoying girl ass. Oh. Was she fucking, was she fucking with you, Jish? <laughs> or was she just one of them people you just can take and you just had to go molly walk you can beat her up after school so you wouldn't have got suspended you had a whoop on her in school see we're not trying to miss school so you know when everybody is walking down the street that's when you tap Vine on the shoulder and say, we need to have a conversation and you hitting that shoulder. So they know business. And by that time, whatever happened has happened. But you don't beat them up in school. 
You got to. What am I scrolling up to? I think they're talking about Vogue. Oh, Vogue again. Oh, no. No. Somebody said that they whoops, they got suspended from school for beating some ass. So what are y'all talking about? I'm not Vogue no more. He got fired, but HR is still trying to see what's under the rug because he... <coughs> Wait two minutes. No, nah, dude. No, 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 ma'am. Uh-uh. You can't sweep that underneath the rug. No, you cannot. No, Tino Shade. Baby, you can sue the fuck out of HR. You can sue the fuck out that company. So y'all better think about that. Because if that was me, <clears throat> and they're trying to sweep it, oh, baby, I would start keeping all the documents. I would start video shitting. I would start doing everything. I would call me an attorney right now. And look, this is what I'm going through. That's a lawsuit. They can't. Oh, she won't leave you alone. Also, you see, sometimes you got to whoop that ass. I ain't going to scroll up, Shay. Just type it again. Because I don't know what I'm scrolling up for. And all that. I ain't got time for that. I'm sorry. I'll read the dress next time I'm there. Okay. I will. Oh, that's what you were saying. But, girl, you could have texted me that, honey. But then I may add, like, a little... I was going to add, like, these rhinestone brooches that I had because I thought it was cute. But, um... Yeah. Are you in Vegas? Get your chair. You out there working at home. Damn. Didn't I tell you I just brought my ass in here and went to sleep? Mm-hmm. <laughs> hey, Judge. What did you miss? Not much. And girl, shit, I can't remember what we talked about. I don't remember this the first round <clears throat> or the second round. I can't remember this the first blunt or the second damn blunt. I think it's the second. I just know I went and got a massage today. And it, oh my gosh. So if you have the flu or if you're going through that ache and pain shit, just go get you a nice little $12 massage. Because what it did to me is it like opened up my area. You know, my all this feel like open. Like I, like I'm, I, I, it, it, it got it all up out of there. Because you aching and you paining, you're not sleeping right, your body all cramped up, you still going to be sore. Go get that motherfucker and let them go in there. Just go. And go. And go. Baby, I paid that man, I promise you. <clears throat> I stood there for like three minutes. And I was thinking, should I pay more and just lay on that bed and just pass the fuck out? But then I said, no, bitch, just go home. Because that was one of the, and he always hurts me. Because he just be, mm, mm. But I was like, not hard. Do a soft medium. And I'm sore. And he did it just perfect. I tipped them two ten dollars. Shit, that was almost as much as a damn goddamn massage. It was only what sixteen, seventeen dollars. But he had did such an amazing job. I was like, 
Wow. Fuck. And I was trying to go to my lady that walk on my back. But I, um, by the time I got there, that was closed. Shit. And it was traffic too on that 405. And it was Friday. Baby, please. The 405 by the LAX. No, ma'am. You're not going nowhere fast. Sit down and relax. Because we are going to tap and go. And then we're going to pause for 20 minutes. What, who bought what? Have I tried Hot Rocks? No. What are Hot Rocks? What did I eat today? Nothing. I didn't eat nothing today. <clears throat> because after I got out, What did I do? Oh, uh, when I got a money order. The post office. Got a massage and came back home and went to sleep. So I didn't even eat. I forgot to eat. I forgot to pay my water bill. Damn. I don't know. I have something in there I'm going to cook. What am I doing tonight? I was going to go see Proud Mary, but my friend said it was boring. So. <laughs> and our taste is, you know, very similar on things, you know, about movies and stuff. And. I just don't have the time. It's like, no, I'm, I still may go see it, though. You know, shit, fuck it. I love Taraji. Gotta make sure my girl's sales be up so she can win thine awards. So I'm thinking about going to the movies. Because I really want some nachos with some jalapenos. And a large fruit punch. Or a raspberry tea. Bingo! If they got raspberry tea, it's a wrap. The only thing is, I drink it so damn fast, I be pissy. So I'm running back and forth to the bathroom. Yeah, but I'm, I love Taraji, so I'm going to go see her movie tonight. That's what I'm going to do. Because the last one stopped showing at 12.15. And it's playing at a couple of theaters down here, like in two and three different uh, movie scenes. So it's going to be going all night. You love raspberry tea? Me too. When I, if I ask for coffee, raspberry tea, and that's it. You want water? No, ma'am. <laughs> I don't want none of your tap water. I'm good. Give me some coffee. Give me some raspberry. The raspberry, give me some type of juice or something. Some type of punch. Because I don't, you know, I don't do tap water. That's fucking up your insides. How it is because you want to see it? Okay. What kind of raspberry tea? I, I don't, I mean, you mean what type of, um, like the brand, because they have so many different brands, but I don't, the sweet one, shit. The one that's sweet. Whatever raspberry that give you the sweet one. I don't like the non-sweet, and I want the one that tastes like Kool-Aid. Yeah. 
Oh, brisk, any type of, it don't matter. It does not matter. It does not matter. Just give me raspberry tea. I just like the way it tastes. But it has to be sweet. I don't want that shit that's not flavor. Mm -mm. You got to add sugar. No, I don't want to do all that. Just give me some raspberry tea and some coffee. <clears throat> then they say decaf. For what? What the fuck is decaf for? What's that doing? I'm trying to calf up. Shit. <laughs> fuck a decaf. What the fuck I'm going to do with some decaf? No, ma'am. The fuck? I'm smoking 15 blunts, bitch, and I need to be up. Decaf going to put me under. The McDonald's. I always get sweet tea. I used to love McDonald's, uh, that orange, that high C orange. Booyah! That high C orange at McDonald's was some dangerous Bama. Do you understand me? You could never go wrong with a high C orange at McDonald's. Tell me if I'm lying. You could never go wrong with the orange high C at McDonald's. Unless you don't like orange, then I can understand. But if your flavor is right and you could do orange, don't play with me. The high C orange. And they fuck you over because they give you them thick ass straws you gotta suck out of. So when you take one one suck out of it, you take and really like three fucking sucks. So your shit is just gone before you get a house and stare around. Right That's why I be like, nah, don't use don't use them big straws. And don't put so much ice in my cup. Nope, I don't need all that ice. Easy on the ice, baby. Just sit, this is gonna cut off you guys. <laughs> 